All right. Hey, you made it back. C.K. Danger Song. Underground Craps. Can't hope this camera can, is going to be able to catch everything here. I think it is. I mean, we'll try to keep it at this, man. Sorry about that. Uh, the video yesterday, I was trying to obviously capture the release, and I'm not able to really get that release like I want, man. So just bear with me. I'm not a professional cameraman or not, not like that, guys. Um, today is Thursday. We're making it to Thursday. Uh, this one's going to be about bouncy tables and morning session by the way I mean you know throwing the dice okay I threw them twice I think uh, this is gonna be about bouncy tables and controlling the bounce on the bouncy table you, you know cause it's not just you know throwing on a bouncy table it's actually controlling the bounce for instance say when the dice land you know when the dice you know they go you know when you throw the dice boom they hit the wall they come down once they once they start the action after the the wall Okay, once they hit the wall and that action starts, that's when you really want to have that, your bounciness of the, the dice, like the, the action of the dice needs to, they need to shut down within like three, like three bounces, like after they go boom, hit the wall, then come back down, that's going to be one, another one, and another one, like they bounce, if you notice the bounce, come on Bo, shit, damn it, silly. Every damn video, isn't it? Uh, anyway, uh, so yeah. Shit, see that fucking train of thought. But yeah, once they hit, you know, boom, you know, you throw them, they land, you know, hit the table, then they hit the wall. Once they hit the wall and they come back down, they hit. That's when you want to keep them down, keep them uh, from, ah, uh, you really don't want them to scatter like more than three times. You don't want them to hit the table like one, two, three. You don't want them to, you know what I mean? to be bumping all around, just be bumping and tumbling. You want them to kind of shut, you weren't really want them to shut down within like three bounces off the table, you know. I really should put this camera down here so you can see that down there. I'll throw a couple here and uh, so you can see how I'm throwing at least. I'll use this uh, two finger, two finger grip. Got this pinky pushed out to the, t to the front of the dice, not the back, you know. Uh, then we got the thumb down all the way. Now, just wanted to tell you guys, this is a twisted grip, and I'll release them a little bit low, so hopefully you can kind of see that back there. So I'm really wanting you to be able to see that damn release, man, you know? The release is where it's at, man. I'm, you know, I'll get it down, though. I will get that release down for you, though, gang. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. 12, seen that. Box car. Hit this real quick. Hope you guys enjoyed that video from yesterday. We are using all seven on this one today. <sighs> Twisting. Try to keep them a little bit low so you can, you know, see me twisting in there. Twisting them. So I got the camera down so low today. <clears throat> and I really need to take it down there so you can actually see the action. Maybe I'll throw a couple here. Then take you down so you can see the action of the dice. Because you really need to see and understand shutting down the dice. You know, um, see, watching my thumb here. See, they hit, they went boom, boom, boom. You know, boom, 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 like that. I mean, that's, you know, I don't really hear anyone talking too much about that much, but uh, we need to get into a game. It's a fine three. Uh, But, you know, when the dice hit the table and then hit the wall, and they come off the wall, you know, so they hit hit the table, hit the wall. Once they hit the wall and come down, that's when the process begins. That's when you want them to really shut down. You don't want them to, to bump around more than three times. You know, you preferably you want them to shut down like two, like come off the wall, go boom, boom, and then shut down. You know what I mean? Uh, a lot of times you'll get like three and four, and you want to watch those extra ones. You want to watch those extra ones. Four, deuce, six. Now this is a little bit different throw. I'm actually leaning forward and I'm throwing, I'm not throwing as much of a rainbow because I'm trying to get my arm, you know, show you how I'm throwing that right there. Four, two, six, seven, runner. <laughs> Funny runner. Yeah, no music, man, no music. I was like, shit, let me just go in here because, you know, 
still getting ready for the PT today, but I uh, wanted to put this down. So I was going to, so we're going to put it down. Oh, deuce six. And I'm using a very, very strong corkscrew uh, type of a throw. You know, they're really corkscrewing in the air. Eventually, I'm going to get it to where we can, you know, see the actual camera action. I mean, because this is like, I mean, you ain't seen it rolling like this. I'm just telling you. You know, it just does not. I mean, it's way tougher to see it in person than to see it on video. The video ain't shit. It's just really frustrating because you can't get a chance to see some of these rolls I'm doing for you. You know, and like I said, any more, man, it seems like. Did you see all that action? You're like, pit, 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 all that bullshit. That's what I hate. I don't even know what this next number is down here. Let's see. Pull this guy around. So we got five, three, eight. Your guess was as good as mine on that one, gang. You know what I mean, though? When it hits the, the felt, hits it, the wall, and then comes back down and hits once, you, that's when the dice need to be really controlled. You know, they don't, you do not want them to sit there and bump and bump and bump. You don't want them to bump and bump and bump. Trust me. You know, all that action, that's when, that's when the damage happens. That's when the seven comes out, man. Did you see how it was like, bit, 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 bit. You know, I think it was like three times after that. You know, four, two, six. Okay, we're going to take you down there now. So you can see the, uh, you know, take you into the action over there. So you can see what's going on. Once you see that action. And... What we'll do, well, we'll just, I was going to pause you, but we'll just take you on in, man. I hope I don't fucking get you up here, man. Bring you on down. Bring you on down. See where we're at so far. Shooting a very tight range today. Very tight range. Of course, we got our chips here. Always good to use the chips. Okay. We just got two right there today. People in the pass line and I ain't even taking advantage of their, uh, odds over there so let's see here hang on guys i'm gonna push pause and get this set so you don't have to go through all this fidgeting okay pause is off now we're back we got you right in there real tight gang you're in there real tight so now watch when the dice hit this is what i'm talking about the dice this is i mean this is a lesson that you get thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of fucking hits man not this bullshit out there i won't get on a rant but i'm just saying Damn it. I mean, this is huge, dude. This is huge. Just like that Premier Grip shit. That is huge. Too many fucking people are opening up their hand, man. And they're, they're losing money like that. They're losing money because they're losing an extra roll or two or three. You know, because instead of releasing, boom, see the hands close. And your thumb doesn't have to be like that. It can be, some might be like that. See, there's a lo there is a difference between thumb being like that and like that. See what I mean? There is a difference. Mine is like that. I see hands closed. Fingers closed. See, all, you want all that? Not, not that. Not that. Not that. Okay. But this one, when they hit dice, hit, hit, boom, or they hit in here, they come off the wall. This, once they come off the wall, this is when the action starts. This is it right here, gang. This is it. This is what they don't want you to know about. They don't want you to learn that once the dice come off the wall, this action is what you want to really control. Right here. You want this action to be controlled. You want to go boom. Hit once, maybe boom, boom, and come to rest. You don't want more than three, three booms. You don't want more than three bounces after the wall. After they hit the wall, you don't want more than three. Trust me. You don't believe me? You go back and look at it, and you throw the dice, throw the dice, and look how many times your dice are bouncing around. You know, like, so look, watch, so hit the wall. See that one? That went boom, and then it said boom, boom, and this one went boom, 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 boom. You know, like it hit several times over here, but it didn't seven, I'm just saying, you know, you don't want them to sit there and hit the wall and go boom, 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 and just sit there and do all that bouncing, that's why the bouncy table fucks people up, because it'll, it'll go, hit the wall, come down, boom, boom, and they'll want to come to rest, but that extra energy in the table, that super bounciness, the fabric, the shit they're using underneath, gives you that extra bounce, and that one dice might roll over, you know, chump you up, see what I mean? telling you so watch these dice watch how they're coming down see what I'm talking about here gang <clears throat> now look at the uh, how many times they bounce after the landing that's what's key you see that 
This one was like two, and this one was like three. This one was trying to do something. This one right here was trying to get a little bit away, but, you know, this is some in-depth shit that I'm giving you guys here today. I mean, this is, you know, this, and I'm going to release this today. I know the other video doesn't have, you know, the video, the views it should. Everyone hadn't had a chance to see it yet. But, dude, I'm telling you, this is where, this is the game of dice control right here. This is it right here. This is it. Watch how many times it bounces off the wall. You see that? It went boom, boom, boop, boop, and it did like a three and then rolled out. You see what I'm saying? You got to look really, it's a four hard. You got to really look at the dice. Really look at the dice and study the dice. I've been saying that forever in all my videos, gang. You know that. Study your dice, study the action. And this is a part of studying the dice action. That's all it is. We're studying our dice action and learning what our dice are doing once they come off the wall. We can't be lazy about that can't be lazy about that. We have to understand what our dice are doing off the wall. Now watch this one. See, it was like boom, boop, 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 boop. See what I mean? Three, one, four. I gotta pull this one over right here. Make it a little easier, more efficient. See if we can get another one here for you. Once you really see that dice action off the wall, how they're the bumping. And those just eased on in. You know, they eased on in, and that was okay. You see it? They came off the wall and they like bumped twice, then they rolled on in. And I hope I hope you guys are kind of, are understanding what I'm saying about that bouncing off the wall. I'm really trying to put it out there as strong as I can, man. You see that? Hit the wall, went boom, boom, then this one like boom, you know, settled down, then this one maybe hit a three, rolled out. Ten, boom, ten, boom. So that's what that lesson's about, though, gang. It's about, you know, keeping them, keeping the dice, you know, in a certain range. A bounce, okay? Because if you don't control the bounce, they'll get they'll get away from you. Especially like with grips that uh, when you use rainbows, um, like the Premier Grip, you know that bounciness is a killer. That's why I'm using. You know, you see how you know moved into corkscrew type throws, that kind of thing. Now uh, this throw I'm using is a corkscrewer. We're we're using a two finger, middle and the first finger. These fingers are up on the tip of the dice. We're up on the tip. The thumb is on the bottom. See, normally I do that one where they're full, the fingers all the way down, like that. And this finger, see where this finger's back like that? This is key. This is like your steering finger, trust me. This is key. That is key right here. This is key. Okay? Um, and the thumb goes all the way down on that. And I'm using the finger up front. It's up front. It's not all the way, all the way back. So... So one or two more here, gang. Get on down the road. We know we shot a long one yesterday. We don't want this one to be another one. Not at all. Plus, I gotta, I gotta go. We'll drop this in about noon today, maybe. Watch the bounce on this after the wall hit. See that? It went blip, boom, boom, boom. It went blip, boom, boom, boom. See what I'm saying? Three, one, oh. Three, one, oh. Okay, gang. World record breaking. Watch the bounce after it hits the wall. Watch the action after it hits the wall. No more than three. You see it? Blip. Boom, boom, boom. You see it went blip. Boom, boom, boom. You know? It went blip. And then it just went boom, boom, boom. Like a little three. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, okay? This is some very, very high level. Extremely high level. It really is. It really is. The pros out there are going to understand what I'm talking about. Extremely high level. That, that's it, guys. That's all on that. We're going to have to get out of here in 15 minutes. We're going to cut this short. Do apologize. But, um, you can see dogs barking, so. But, um, yeah, that's how we did it, though, gang. That's how we did it. Let's see what we did there. So we just do a little 
14 for you real quick. A little point on the 10. Guys in the way. Bring you back. Are you? So, and how are we through that one? Bodie, come on. So, we threw it. See, remember? Up on the tip. Thumb all the way down. Finger. So, the finger's right there. It's not back. It's actually forward. That's your steering finger. And, guys, I'm going to do a video about, um, you know, um, about what it feels like now for me personally as a dice controller. Um, it feels like I'm pitching the dice. You know, it feels like I'm pitching the dice because there's so many ways to throw the dice. You never know what throw or what pitch of the dice you're going to need. See, so, it's starting to get a little sticky here. See? I just set right on here. You guys have seen this before. Seen this before. See, I set up around there. Just like that. See, I got the nice little tilt. Nice little tilt. Corkscrew. Damn, six, two, eight. Cork. Yeah, well, I got a guy here on that, man. I fucking hear him out there doing the bullshit. Doing the bullshit, of course. This used to happen last year, man. Doing my videos. So, it's our fourth eight gang. We'll get out of here on that note. That's how we did that throw, though. That's how we did that throw. You know, uh, we had a chance to see back here how we set it up. Down there, how we did it. Um, you know, see the bounce. You know, remember, remember on this one, guys. I mean, this is just straight solid about the bounce and controlling the bounce after it hits the wall. After the dice hit the wall, so after they hit the wall, boom, come down. So the dice hit the wall, boom, come down. Once after the wall, after they hit the wall, not before they hit the wall, but after they hit the wall, hit the wall, that starts the process. Wall, one, two, three, however they go. You don't want them to be over three. That was an all seven set reason, by the way. You don't want them to bounce more than three times. I know some people are going to be like, oh man, whatever. Well, yeah, that's where your control needs to be if you want to be nasty. I mean, that's, you know, I can do it. You can do it. I'm just saying, you know, it might take you a little bit to do it, but, you know, because I've been doing it. You know what I mean? I've got this, you know, bouncy table shit down. I mean, ridiculous. I mean, ridiculous. Hey, hold on. Hang on a second, guys. It's pissed. All right, guys. So showed you how to throw it. Did the thing. Um, hey, remember pull your money. Uh, remember to control the dice action off the wall. Okay, off the walls where you want to be, gang. Off the wall control. Okay, off the wall control. Believe me when I tell you that. This is the corkscrew. Down about two inches. Boom, 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 boom. Three, one. Point on the way out. Point on the way out. There's a fours and tens for you. Point. So it looks like we just banged our second point on that one. Fourth, uh, fourth four. Second point. And that's why I try to just cut myself from rolling because I'll keep rolling and next thing you know I start to get warm. Like, oh shit, then I'm banging in the 20s. <clears throat> you know we're at my average now pretty much close to 20 that's how we did it like that twist them about two inches down see it was like boom 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 you know like three of them four deuce six a lot of four deuce sixes okay gang the ck dangerous arm we'll uh underground craps appreciate everyone's time we'll be back with another one i'll you know talk uh talk a little shit with you you know, uh, this one didn't really have a chance to talk much. Not one five or nine, by the way. Oh my gosh, what a funny one. Four fours, zero fives, four sixes, four eights, uh, three fours. Or, I mean, three tens. You know, no, uh, zero nines. Zero nines. So, you know. Oh shit, I guess I didn't pull those back to show you. My fault. Hey, so appreciate your time, guys. Um. Remember again, pull your money and really try to concentrate 
remember the premier grip lesson and then also remember this right here control the bounce after they hit the, the wall after they hit the wall they hit the wall they come down one two three trust me you watch and you watch it see that that's why that's why I do those funky grips like when I do this one right here this one like we're doing we're only you know we're just you know releasing you know like that corkscrewing like like that about you know about a release like that out there see so setting up like this boom like that but we're not getting it turned over now when we get it turned over the dice will flatten out they'll land they'll flatten they'll land flat hit the wall and they'll only get about two bumps you know what I mean one or two you know what I mean it just shuts them down so I'm just telling you you don't want more than three bounces after it hits the wall okay guys C K Danger Song underground craps we're running to 1500 daddy 1500 subs and then we're going to 2000 fast appreciate your time guys uh haven't been on the chats down there as much but uh apologize uh we will be interacting more i definitely apologize i've been you know taking care of some things here at the house but i certainly am keeping up for the videos for you guys and uh you know really putting some some thought into these videos because you know i'm not putting them out every day not that when i put them out every day i wasn't putting thought into them but i'm really putting thought into them like the premier grip i seen a video where dude was just opening up his hand real bad and i thought damn we better get that out to everyone and let them know that you know fuck that you don't want to do that bullshit you know what i mean this is how you want it you see what i'm saying premier grip boom uh like i said this throw we're hitting uh using uh all seven landing about two inches out from the wall, hitting. You'd hear it go, boop, 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 boop. You know what I mean? Like three of them. You could hear them. You know that's what you want. That's what you want, gang. I uh, appreciate your time. Hell, I don't know what else to say, man. Uh, let's go out on this note. The little smoke. What do you say? If you haven't subscribed yet, gang, don't forget to subscribe. It's important. Cause you're gonna miss a lot of underground videos because you done found the underground. Very few of us out here. And we're showing you what the casino doesn't want you to know. They don't want you to know this lesson I just showed you, gang. Believe me, it's strong. Don't take this lit video lightly. Do not take the message of this video lightly okay study the action control the action off the wall and the way you control the action off the wall is the dice throw that you use the throw that you use will impact will give you the result after the dice hit the wall see so that's why I'm using the corkscrew because it shuts them down that's why I'm using a corkscrew because I throw them. See, it's like, you know, like that. See, just three, you know, just three of them. That's all you want. It's three. We just threw them out there. We didn't, you know what I mean? Didn't set them or anything like that. Didn't even see what it was. Just showing you how it actually hits and and just three times. If you get more than that, it just seems like you're really. You go check it out. I gave you the information. Now just go check it out, guys. And hey, we'll see you next time. C.K. Danger Song. Underground craps. Appreciate your time, gang. Number love for you. Appreciate the veterans. See you next time. Oh, by the way, you run into those haters out there, man. Fuck them bitches. You know what I mean? You're going to have haters because they're losers. You know? They don't know how to. They don't know how to accept losing. Kind of like Hillary Clinton, uh, people. They can't accept losing. Oh, by the way, one more word. Fuck uh, LeBron James and uh, uh, I used to like him too, but my dude Curry on uh, uh, the the uh, on the on the NBA shit. Fuck them busters, man. Fuck them busters. I I just didn't get a chance to do a video on Warrior Reports where I crush them out, man. Cause fuck them. You know, talking about. Oh, we're not going to go to the White House either way. You know what I mean? Whatever. Soft-ass LeBron. Vegas looks like they're going to have it right with them bitches not even winning the game. Sorry to the Cleveland fans. Sorry about that. I just don't like LeBron, man. And, uh, you know what I mean? I just don't think he's got the heart like that, man. Whatever. He's just not. Whatever, dude. But, uh, 
It's not the time or place for me to go into that. I just want to say, fuck them bitches, man. Even though I like Curry. Don't like LeBron, but even though I like Curry, fuck them. You know what I mean? Talking about, oh, well, either way, whoever team wins, we're not going to go to the White House and all this bullshit because they're all fucked up and, you know what I mean, thinking LeBron's a racist and all this old punk-ass shit, man. Fuck them bitches, man. Anyway, hey, sorry about that, guys. A lot of people probably won't catch that, but it's all right because, you know, a lot of people don't watch them all the way to the... You know, you know, I don't know how what percentage of people watch it to the end, but you know what I'm saying? Probably won't watch it to the end. That's right, so probably get away with that. But it just is what it is, man. That's what I feel about them bitches, man. Overpaid crybabies. Trump's not a racist, fuckers. I'm not talking to my viewers. I'm just saying those dudes. High-paid bitches, you know what I mean? Overpaid and then crying. Whatever, dude. See you next time, gang. <laughs> a little derail there. Hey, we'll see you next time. C.K. Dangerous on him, baby. Underground craps. Keep it real, guys. Keep rolling. Stick and move. Pull your money. Keep winning, guys. We'll see you next time. Keep that confidence up, by the way. Always have confidence. Never let a fucking person take your confidence. Damn it. And I say that with authority because fuck that. Don't never let no one take your confidence. Be bold. Be bold. These fuckers out here who, who who talk this random bullshit, they're lazy. And we'll get I got another video I'm gonna put out and it's gonna be on focus. Okay? We'll see you next time.